Hey everyone, it's Laura. I did something. <laughs> I ordered some of the um, Grease and Revolution collection. They It just launched last week. They did a collaboration. It's one of my favorite movies. I haven't talked about it much. Everybody knows I love The Wizard of Oz. I talk about that a lot, but Grease was also one of my favorites from when I was really little. Fun fact, I saw it in the theater. The movie came out in 78 or 77, one of the two. I think 78. So I would have been like six. I had no business seeing that movie. Granted, I think it's PG, but listen to the lyrics to Grease Lightning. I mean, I had no business seeing that, but I didn't know what they were talking about. I just like the singing and dancing. And I loved Olivia Newton-John. And I had a big crush on John Travolta. He was probably like my first celebrity crush. So anyway, when I saw that they were launching a collaboration, a collection, I decided I wanted to get it. I was hoping they would have like the full collection for sale, but it, like as a package, do you know what I mean? Then you kind of save a little bit of money, but they didn't. They just had everything individually. So I didn't get everything. I got enough though. So anyway, without further ado, so this is what the box looks like. It had a pull tab and then it, it opens like that and it says quality affordable cruelty free beauty for everyone you are the revolution they're not known for having the best quality in the world um, but this is one of those things i ordered because it's a collector's item although some of it i will use and i will show you so there was um three different palettes a big palette that looked like the car, like Grease Lightning. I didn't get that. I got the two smaller palettes because they're so darn cute. It's the, oopsie, <laughs> sorry. It's the jackets, the pink ladies and the T-Birds jacket. <laughs> I just had to have that. So let's look at those. I probably won't swatch the palettes, but we'll see. Um, oh, scissors. They got the little uh, stickers on the tab little tab stickers on there okay so this is the t-birds one john travolta was so gorgeous in that movie at the very first or i think it's like the very start of the movie where someone calls his name and he turns around and looks at the camera and smiles and oh god the blue eyes with the dark hair and oh yeah anyway <laughs> so this is what it looks like. Oh, that's upside down. I'm having problems today. So it says Grease times Revolution, Makeup Revolution London, T-Birds, Rock and Roll T-Birds palette. And then it opens like that. There's no mirror. And it says, that's my name. Don't wear it out. <laughs> and then it has like T-Birds all over it. And then these are the colors. And I actually love those colors. I just don't know if I'm going to use them. They're called, oh, these names are great. Systematic. High dramatic, automatic, lightning, burning, cruising, greased, coasting, and fuel injection. So all, you know, words from Grease Lightning. I won't sing for you guys because you don't nobody needs to hear that. I cannot sing to save my life. Okay. Now this one is the Pink Ladies palette. Looks like that. So it's their jacket. I wanted one of those jackets so bad. Okay. So pink ladies, pink rules palette. So this is also going to open like that. And this one says too pure to be pink. That's what they said about Sandy, who was my favorite. I was a Sandy person. Oh, love me some Olivia Newton-John. Those are the colors. That's really pretty too. So they are look cool, think pink, too pure, peachy keen, looker, rule the school, go get them, beauty school, and love or hate great names i love it and there is a little magnet inside there to keep that closed so that's that palette and then i got because this is i love you're the one that i want because i love the end of the movie you know when sandy makes her transformation but probably my all-time favorite song from the movie is hopelessly devoted to you because it's olivia and she's so beautiful and she sings so pretty and so this is the Hopelessly Devoted Highlighter Palette, and it is super sparkly. Um, I'll put the cost for all this stuff in the description below. I can't remember. I, I know I paid like 60 bucks for everything, but I don't remember like how much each individual thing was. Um, boy, if I could open this, that would be great. There we go. Wow, those are sparkly. So that's what that looks like. I really only bought it for the name. <laughs> 
because it's an hopelessly devoted. This I will swatch. Let's swatch. Okay, so that's that first one, the first light pink. This is like the rosy one. And this is that gold one. And then this is, I went out of order on my fingers, but this is this one. So I think those sparklies, that's just an overspray because once I swatch it, it like goes away. Can you see how, see how there's sparklies there? Now watch when I run my finger over it, now they're gone. So that's probably a good thing because then I'd be more likely to use it. But that's, that's way too dark for a highlighter. That to me is a blush. I did a terrible job swatching with my pinky, but that's cute. I don't know if I'll use it, but I just like the name. I don't want to mess with the eyeshadow palette, but I thought the highlighter palette, I'll go ahead and swatch that. Um, need a, a wipe. Sorry, guys. Okay, then the rest are lippies. Imagine that. So they had three individual lippies. They had Frenchie, Sandy, and Rizzo. And I got two of them. I got Sandy and Frenchie just based on the colors. Um, and then I got a little kit. So, But I'll show you the individual lippies first. And I picked these, like I said, because of the colors. Because I think the Rizzo one was a red. Which I do wear red lipstick, but I have so many. And I will reach for these before I will reach for a red. So... Lipsticks I, I usually don't keep as like collector pieces. I'll keep the box though because the box is super cute. It's got the picture of the jacket on it. So this is the sandy one. It says on the side, tell me about it, stud. <laughs> That's my favorite scene in the movie. And oh, is she pretty? It's iridescent pink. And then the shade is like a nude mauve pink. So I'm going to go ahead and put that on. The mirror is right here. Oh, it's a really pretty everyday color. Perfect for Miss Sandy. You know, pre-transformation Sandy, that is. So that's that one. And then I got Frenchie, which is a brighter pink. So let's open that one up. Hopefully. Okay. And what is the quote on that? Oh, duty, how do I look? Um, that's from when she when she goes to the dance and he says, you look like a, what did he say? Uh, something about a pineapple? Because her hair is like super blonde. Okay, so this is her color. Ooh, that's pretty. I kind of wish I would put that one on, but I like them both, but that one's more, more pink. Pretty, okay. So that's that. Then the last thing I got was this kit because it's so stinking cute. <laughs> it says, tell me about it, stud. So this is like, they called this the Sandy Transformation Kit from when she, you know, switches from a sweet little innocent woman or girl to being, you know, who she is at the end of the movie to try to get Danny back. So this has a mascara, an eyeliner, and a lip gloss. I just thought that was so cute. <laughs> I got such a kick out of this set. I, again, I wish they would have had like a PR package where you could get everything, but, and then, you know, usually you get a little bit off that way. So I got, I'm trying to think what else I didn't get. There was one lippy that I didn't get. Like I mentioned, the big palette. Oh, there were some brushes and maybe some sponges that I didn't get. So this is the mascara, I believe. It says, tell me about it, stud. And what the heck, we're gonna open it. Okay, so that's the brush. Nothing too exciting. It smells like mascara. And then we got a black eyeliner. Cause you know, at the end of the movie, she has like, you know, the red lips and the dark eyeliner and the big poofy hair. So that is super cute. So it's red with little hearts all over it. And this is going to be a brush style. Yeah. So got a brush liquid black eyeliner. I'll use that. I, I like black eyeliners. And then here is the lip gloss. And again, the same kind of packaging with the hearts and little like lightning bolts. And this is probably a red. Yep. Oh, that's pretty. I wonder if I can put that over this one. We're going to try it. 
Look at that. See, now I'm Sandy at the end of the movie. That's really pretty. It actually goes really well with that lipstick. I messed it up, but you know, that's what I do. Okay, so that's what I got from the Makeup Revolution times Grease, um, or Grease times Makeup Revolution set um, collaboration. I can't talk today. <laughs> I just thought it was super cute, and I love that movie, and I'm happy with this. It's, it's adorable. So thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you on my next video. Bye-bye.